Hey, last time on Baba is You, I got stuck on some puzzles. I figured out the puzzles though. Let's go through them one at a time. Heavy words. No, no, no. I want to. <laughs> I want to do the pit. Which one's the pit? This one's the pit. So the pit. When I left off on this one, I had a theory, and the theory was we needed to make a lot of words vertical and push them down, and then move off of the words. We will fall, stack on top of each other, and then we will be able to actually break the fall connection and then walk to the door. Because here's the solution to the puzzle. Door is sink, we have a star and a moon. We need both the star and the moon to be us, and then we can t have one of the us's touch the door, the other us can walk to the flag. In order to solve that, we need to push the words down to the bottom of the pit, making sure fall is the last word, so that we can break it at the bottom of the pit and then walk up. Because if we if we don't break it, then if we fall down here, we just get stuck. So and yeah, I did I did solve this puzzle. But really, I had the solution to this puzzle. What I had to do was just freaking go through the motions and figure out how, you know what the actual correct order of everything was, you know? Like what is the correct order for the uh, for the words going down the pit? And I did figure that out, so let's actually go through that real quick. So, we want to make this down one more. It doesn't matter if it's star or moon is us, but what we want is we want to make sure that we can make moon is you or star is you vertical. Once we can make it vertical, we can actually push star is you as part of our... Uh, as part of our, uh, you know, vertical line of words, because we need the vertical line of words. So, we're going to start with fall. This has to be at the bottom, because here's the thing, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have nine words. If we push a word, we can, we can start the column of words at the skull going down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We can create the uh, the word fall. We can push this word fall one up from the very bottom row. Now, if we are fall and push and we have the moon and the star together, there's a very interesting thing that happens. What happens is that you can stack the moon and the star on top of each other. So if we stack the moon and the star on top of each other and we have fall next to us, we can push fall out of the way and then we walk to the exit. So how do we do that? Well, first of all, if we make moon is star, we can simplify the process, and we can stack them on top of each other, that's not a problem. What I was struggling with last time was figuring out what to do with the moon is, because star is you, and push, and fall is the, the rule set that we needed, but the moon is, having two extra words that I couldn't figure out what to deal with, that was what was causing me problems. But we can put the is fall and we can deal with one of the extra words the is can just be a component of the rule set for falling star is you and is fall it's it, it's valid it works so what we do is we start pushing all of these things over and push and fall moon is just the garbage word at the beginning of the of the column segment here everything is valid push everything down as far as we can go don't push one more or else we die and then if we fall off they the stars stack because we can't move we can't we can't not be stacked and we can't get to that door unless we break fall so you break fall sink the door hit the flag I had the solution last time it's just that I didn't know what order to set the words up in and I figured it out trio me is push and Kiki move is this was an interesting one Again, we know what the, we know what we need to do. We need to find a way that that Kiki can walk through the skulls, fall down. I guess we'll just do it like this: walk through the skulls, fall down, walk left, and push the word defeat left. Because once that happens, we can push skull down, push is over, hit the flag. Once the word defeat is no longer there, we can come down here, hit the flag. How do we do that? Well. <laughs> If you put Kiki here, next to the skull, and have them walk, Kiki will walk, fall, face right, and then just get stuck here, moving back and forth. We need to get Kiki to fall left, facing left, so that they will actually walk this way and push defeat out. There's a way of doing it. The way of doing it is we have to use 
me and Kiki at the same freaking time. Right, that's not how that works. Um, what we can do, and let me actually see if I can, I can show this off real quick. Right, we need Kiki is push really quickly here. What we can do is um, if we make this command, Kiki and me is... Oh, hold on. Do it like this. Kiki and me... Oh my god! <sighs> okay. Me is push. Move. Me is... Push, push you there, move it up, move it over. If we do this command, Kiki and me is move, me is push, they'll both move. What happens if they both move? Well, if you're looking at it, you'll notice. Kiki is pointing left, Kiki is pointing right. What we can do is we can make them both walk to the right, hit this cloud, turn around, and then we can make Kiki fall, walk left, hit defeat, and hit the exit. So, it is getting them here pointed to the right, walking through the skulls. I just need to use them both and have them walk on top of each other like freaking idiots. If we can do this, we can make it work. So, Kiki and me is push. Uh, but we need Kiki to be push as well. So we need Kiki and me is push. So we can push these guys into position. We want them both to be pointed to the right, which we can do here. Actually, we need to do this real quick so we can make me is push. Sorry, Kiki has to be push. Kiki and me is push? No, me is push. No, Kiki has to be push. I'm confusing myself here. <laughs> Kiki needs to be push and pointed to the right. We can do that. Well, I have to abuse the word move here real quick. Good enough. Now, me needs to be push. Let's steal the word is. Steal the word move. Kiki and me is move. Then they start walking. Hit the cloud, they turn around. Now we break their movement command, and if we make me no longer push, the purple one, the red one, Kiki, is gonna fall down. And when he's gonna fall down, pointed to the right, and if he's falling down, pointed to the right, that means he can push the word defeat out of the way, we can hit the exit, we win. So once you figure out that you can make them stack on top of each other and walk at the same time, the solution becomes a little bit easier. If Abe had an in theory emote here, this is where I'd use it. <laughs> Look, I'll have to make one. It'll happen, I swear. Anyways, what is the name of this one? Heavy words. All the words here fall. Sucks, don't it? Um, what we need to do is we need to make stars push, push the star out of the way, dust needs to be defeat, and then when we break the dust, we can make moon is win, and then hit the moon, and then win the level. The problem is the belt. Once you pass the belt, you can't get back. So we can't make dust is weak, and then break the dust, and then leave, and then set up the, the moon command to make moon is win. We have to do it all before we pass the conveyor belt. But the solution to this puzzle is a little bit easier than I thought it was going to be. Here I was thinking, I had a couple of thoughts. One thought was, push all five of these words down to the left here and try to make them stack in a particular method or in a particular way. Um, I was also thinking maybe you could use this little landing here and uh, kind of like pour the words out here and then pour the words out here and then make something happen. The real problem, the real sticking point for this was the fact that we only have two is's. We need three conditions. Star is push, dust is weak, moon is win. You can't make all of these happen at the same time. As a result, you have to make one, break it, and then reuse one of the is's, right? Here's the thing that, uh, here's the thing that once I noticed it, I realized I could actually solve it. What the hell is this little one brick wide, one open empty tile wide 
spot right here for it. It's gotta be important. Yes, it is. Here's what you do. Stars push. Push the star in the corner. And then, if you break, star is push. And this is the thing that it took me long, it took me far too long to realize. But if you break, star is push. You can reuse that square. That's how, that's the solution. By reusing the square, we can actually use this space down here to make a command, to make a word. Because now you have enough room that if you, if you just dump words down here, you can actually, you know, interact with it in some manner. We don't want to make stars weak or anything like that. What we really want is we want to make dust is weak. So we're going to push the word dust down. Uh, but we can't make moon is dust. We cannot make moon is dust. That breaks it. So we have to move the is over. Move the weak over. Put the weak into the proper position. I did this wrong. We need to move moon to the left is actually what we need to do first. Moon left. Weak over. We need to to put down weak is dust in that order. So weak has to go first. It gets pushed to the right. Because this is going to be where our dust is weak is going to go. Then dust goes down. After is, dust is weak. We get the star pushed in. Then we can break star's push, oh! and then uh, get rid of the word star. We can just clear space. Then we need to make moon is win down here. Okay, well, win is the first word that we're going to need. Let's push it through the conveyor belt. Is is the second word we're going to need. Whoops, one too many. And then we can just add the word moon. Moon is win. We can just push the words through, and who cares? The dust, even though it's defeat, it's weak, so we destroy it. Moon is win, we've won. So that's the third puzzle solution. We actually unlocked a bonus level. Oh god, heavy cloud. Mm, oh, sure, why not? And this is where we get stuck for the next 40 minutes. <laughs> Can you make dust is weak, destroy the dust, and then break the dust is weak? It doesn't matter because um, in order to break the dust, you have to get down there with the dust, right? You have to get down there with the uh, with the dust to break it, and if you can't, like, once you pass the conveyor belt, you can't go back anyways. Anyways, what the hell is this? Belt is shift, text is fall and float, wall and cloud is stop, rocket is use, stars defeat, dust is defeat, and dust. Ah! We've lost the ability to have the a throwaway zone, and we now can no longer filter words out of this box, pour words out of the box. So, what the hell do you do here? We need dust as defeat, and then we need to push the star somehow? What are we doing with the star? All we need is moon is win. All we need is moon is when dust is weak, and then we win, I think. But again, I think the problem is really the, uh, um... <clears throat> Sorry, I think the problem is just that we have to reuse one of the is's, but we have to find a different way of doing it. And I have an idea. If we make dust is weak, Ah, oh, no, that's not gonna work. I was thinking if we can make dust is weak, then we can push the star here and then move the word win over, uh, put it on this pedestal and then drop it down, but I don't think that works. Let's make stars push. Dust kills us, we have to make dust is weak. Do we make it to the left or to the right? If we make dust is weak to the right, we cannot reuse the word is. It'll get stuck down here in the hole. But what else are we going to do? We can't really, um... We can't really get the words moon or wind past this little too wide gap here. I could use the star as a platform, but that's not enough. Star is win? That's a good point. Um, except star is also defeat. I don't know what happens with that conflicting rule set. 
stars defeat stars win, what would it do? <laughs> you know? Um, so, I mean, in, in theory, it could work, but I don't know. It's worth a shot, though. It's something I think we can actually accomplish that, so let's give it a shot. So we need to make dust is win vertical here in the middle. We can do that. Um, we just need to break moon, so moon does not become dust. Or, sorry, dust is weak. What am I saying? Dust is weak. Star is push. Push the star over. We can push the star right. Um, actually, what we can do is dump the word moon because we don't dump the word moon because we don't need it. We're gonna make the star win. Then win. Star. This is a tricky one. How do you how do you handle the is right now? Can you handle the is? Can we even make stars win right here? I can push star to the left, but then if we drop the win or the is down, we cannot actually make stars win right here. So I, I don't think we can make stars win. Unfortunately, it's a good idea, but I don't I don't think you can make stars win. Okay, so we can't do that. So. I, we might have to... We might have to push the words to the left and use this space here. Like, there's this little lip here, there's a little hole, and I'm like, what if you push a... Can you push a word into the hole and make something happen? I don't know. Yeah, stars defeat, but again, I don't know what happens with the conflicting rule, stars defeat, stars win. Would it kill you or would it win you? <laughs> you know, I don't know. I guess it would probably destroy you. But stars defeat star is, um, or sorry, dust is defeat, dust is weak means you destroy the dust before it destroys you. Why does that happen? I don't know. So this is an interesting one. We can make stars push through the conveyor belt. But that, it feels like that doesn't help us, because it's not like we're reusing the words anyways, or not like we're trying to reuse the words. We need to find some way of reusing an is, so we can make dust is weak, moon is win at the same time. I think. I think we have to make them at the same time. Um... Moon is dust, right? We don't want, do not want moon to be dust. Dust is win. Hey, you know what? That's actually a very easy way of easy way of determining uh, what happens with dust is win. We can just make dust is win. So if something is defeat and win, it kills you. Okay, we've learned. <laughs> Without having to worry about trying to make the star win, that's what happens. We've done it. Now. Dust is weak has to happen. Moon is win. Would like We would like that to happen. I do have one idea. It's a wonky one. What happens if we have the star hold a word, we push, the star is push through the conveyor belt, and then we break it when we're on the other side to make dust is defeat turn into moon is win? <laughs> or dust is weak, turn it into moon is win. Like, have the word is fall through the star. I think that would actually work. So watch this. We're gonna do this very backwards. Push is star. Star is push. It's going through the conveyor belt. Now, we need to make dust is weak but we need to also be able to put the star underneath the is. We're gonna have dust is weak, moon on the left, win on the right, and the is is gonna be in the middle. Oh no, it's actually gonna be moon win on the bottom, dust is weak on the top, the stars are gonna be in the middle, when the stars no longer push, the word falls, moon is win on the other side. That's what we have to do, but we have to find a way of, of 
creating that situation here. So we need... But let's, let's just dump words, because we know we're going to need to dump the words. Moon, win. Okay, win. Moon. Oh, how do you do that? We need to put the star down there. We need to make dust as weak. I hit restart! Okay, I gotta do this again. <laughs> Should not have done that, but whatever. Could just undo, undid. I always do that. I always restart the level instead of just undoing like four steps. Okay, we need dust as weak. And we need to dump the moon as win over here. So. Do it like... Like this? This doesn't really help me to put things where I need them to go, because we gotta make it... Alright, don't restart. We gotta make it like Moon is Win. All tabbed accidentally. Um, so we'll do an undo. Here's the thing, I don't have to do it over here, I could do it on the left. It might actually be easier to do it on the, on the left. It would also mean that I could move the star more easily. And I'd have a lot more space to position the words. That might make it easier. Okay, we need to make dust is weak. Done. We have access to the star. Can we position the star here and dump words on it from here? Win. Moon. Moon is win. Weak goes to the right. Is goes in the middle. Dust goes here on the left. Then, star is push. Dust is here. Break the dust. Break the star is push. Moon is win. Hit the moon. Took a lot less time than doing the puzzle initially. <laughs> But I guess once I've figured out a solution, it's like, here's a variant on the solution. There we go. We've done it. Guardians. Empty is blank. Text is pull. Ice. UFOs move and defeat. UFO has UFO. UFOs open. So you can't break a UFO. But you could if you wanted to. Bob is you. Ice is ice. Empty is empty. You can't make empty as text or anything like that. Text is pull. That's a weird one. Can we make text is empty? Yeah, I wouldn't recommend it though. That's an existential crisis if I've ever seen one. So text is pull, we can pull the text. And push it. Okay, if we can... If we can create a line of text, we might be able to pull win out. Ice is shut. We can't use ice to do it. We can't make ice is pull. Can we make empty is pull? It actually stops me from moving. That doesn't seem very useful. Uh, maybe I can actually um, do this if I have like words that I can pull with? I don't know. Look, I'm trying to figure this out as I go, okay? Okay, I don't know how to do empty as pull and have it actually work. We could probably do it over the ice, right? Yeah, I can move over the uh, the ice, but I can't break anything unless the text is concluded in the ice. Ah. But ice is shut, UFO is open. We can't just push ice into the UFO path. I think we need to make like a, a, a string of words. One, two, three, four. We have six words. One, two, three, four, five, six. Can't reach. Different solution is needed. Um, ice is ice, empty is empty, Baba is you. We can make Baba something else, but that doesn't seem to matter. Actually, we can't make Baba anything else. And we have six words, but there's an eight column of UFO. It's gotta be some sort of like empty is pull thing, but I think we have to do it over the ice? I'm curious. Empty is pull. 
can we pull these words in somehow? I want to see if we can. Empty is pull. I want to also make text is pull. And then we'll put ice, the word ice, just like over here somewhere. Yeah, we can pull the word ice at a distance. So we can actually do this with the UFOs being here. And then we can just break empty is pull. Or text is pull so we can get out of the out of the uh, the ice. But we have to set up the ice first by the UFOs in order to do it. So this is gonna be um a little bit of a complicated setup at least. Because we gotta move all the ice over. So we need ice is pull. And then we've just gotta like set it up. <laughs> <laughs> Something like this should work. Gives us a decent amount of space to work with. I'm stuck. Don't do that. Crap. Hold on. Just want to create a, a nice little space, you know? That seems acceptable. It's basically as, as good of a spot as I can get it. Okay. So we want text is pull. And then we want empty is pull. This is a cool level. I, I like the idea of this pulling through the uh, the um, the empty. Shit! 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 <laughs> Text is pull. Uh, I gotta. I gotta. I gotta do this slightly differently. <laughs> I, I need to. I don't know what I need to do. Let's just move everything over a little bit. Maybe this will work. Oh my god. We can still break empty as pull. Okay. But I can't... The, the... Okay. How about if we make it like this? Will this allow me to get the hell out of here? No. Because... Okay. Do it like this at the bottom. <laughs> okay. Empties pull. Good. No, wait. UFOs are not in right, the right position. Now they're in the right... Oh my god. <laughs> now they're in the right position. Alright. Pull the word win out. Break empty. Uh, empty is win, but we can't win. What? <laughs> what if you write ice is empty and ice is pull and push the ice into the UFOs? Ice is ice. You can't make ice empty, and empty is empty. You can't make empty ice. But what we can do is make ice win and then win. There you go. Can't make empties win. I guess that's a invalid operation there. Oh. Almost didn't have uh, Skyhold. Almost didn't have any of those. Uh... If I had to restart because I had the ice in the wrong position, I would have been mad. <laughs> it is very sparkly. Box has key. Door is shut. Key is open. Empty is empty. Baba is you. Text is float. Door is door. And wall is stop. Flag is win. Box is box. And key is push. Okay, we gotta open up the door. Door shut. Door is stop. We cannot move the door. We cannot change the door into something else. So we do need to open up the door. What's up? Empty is. Empty is shut. Uh, 
Empty is key? I mean, I know what this is gonna do. Oh no, empty is empty. We can't make empty anything. Oh, that's fine. Box has key. So we need to break the box in order to get a key out of it. I think if we make empty is uh, shut, box is open, it could work, but we actually can't make boxes open. The only thing that's open is a key. We need to be able to break the box somehow. Door is shut. We can make empty shut. But the key is open, not the box. We need to make the box open. We can make box is key. Nope, box is box. Never mind. How do you break the box? There is no weak command, so we can't just push the box into some it box into something else. There's no defeat command, so we can't be the box and then break it somehow. We need to find some way of breaking the stupid box. Box is shut, is open, but we can't move the box to the open. Empty is open? That doesn't help with the door, that also does not help with the box. Box has key, key is empty, we could make box empty? I, I think that would just destroy the box without giving us a key though, but we can we can try it. It'll, it'll definitely do that because It's now no longer has key, and we can't make the box anything else anyways. Okay, door is shut. Door is empty, doesn't work because door is door. Empty is door. I highly doubt this will work. <laughs> uh, it's gonna be, uh, we're gonna feel closed in in a moment. Claustrophobic? No, why does that not work? Empty is door. Empty is empty. Empty is empty, box is box, door is door. Everything is incapable of being transformed except for the key. If we can get the key out, we can't get the key out. Because it's in the box. Could have door has key. What about empty has key? What would that even do? Empty has key? I can't break empty. So even though empty has key, we can't do anything with it. Um, empty is open, empty has key, empty is shut has key still. Key is open, there is no key, so we can't actually open the empty. Open the empty! <laughs> oh. Imagine getting a call, call because of work a bit before 5 a.m., says Reltica. That would suck. The only time I, I've had a call from work was when I was like at a fair, and it's like, I can't get to my computer and within like the next four hours, find someone else. Sorry. I said I was going to the fair today, <laughs> you know? They still call me anyways. Door shut. Empty has key. Empty is, no. Box is, no. Key is. We can't actually affect the word key is open at all. Box is push. Door is stop. Door is. Empty is. So l let's, let's think about what we can interact with. Door is. The only thing door can be is shut because the word door is too far up. Door can be shut or can be not shut. If door is not shut, we're not doing anything with it because it's still stop. We can make something else shut. The box. If the box is shut, we have nothing else to open the box. Box is shut, empty is open. Actually, we might be able... No, because it's not empty though. The, the problem is, empty is open doesn't do anything because even though... It's, it's not like the box is on empty, I don't think. Yeah. Oh, you, if you push it, it works. So if we have empty has key, we can spawn in the key, and then the door can be shut. It, it actually just straight up works. Weird! I didn't expect that to work, but it totally did, and we are one level away from completion of this sector. I don't believe it. Existential crisis. 
<laughs> Flag is win. Cloud is stop. Rocket is push. Moon is defeat. Empty is empty. Empty Baba is you is push. Oh lord. Well, I mean... The so first thing we've got to do is an empty is you. I have to remember how this this puzzle actually works. In fact, I might want to just do horror story again just to remind myself. Empty is you. If there is a space on the right of an object, we can push it left. So what we had had to do, if I remember correctly, was go around in a circle. And then switch back to Baba is you and then touch the flag. Yes. Um. So exis existential crisis. Oh, I bit my tongue earlier. Oh, I hate being sick. So we can make Baba is you. We can make empty is you. Baba is push. It doesn't seem that useful. Um. We gotta move the rocket out of the way, move the moon out of the way, and if we can make the moon move somehow, then we can move win up, become empty, and push win all the way to the left to flag his win. But we have to find some way of actually pushing the moons, and I don't know how to do that. Because the moon is defeat. The moon cannot be pushed. Ah, uh, you know what we can do? Is we can make Baba pushable and then push Baba around. And then we can just become Baba later with the, with the is push commands. So we, we, can, we can actually get that to work. But we need Baba to be push. And we need empty to be you. Let's do it like this. I want to I want to push the word is you up a little bit. So this is kind of just like do it like this. Empty is you. Baba is you. Good. Exactly what I wanted. So we can make Baba is push. Empty is you. So now we can push Baba around and we can get that spaceship out of the way. First things first. I can move the wind, but not very much. Because <laughs> I need to get the Baba in there. The Baba is no longer push if I do that. I need to get the Baba in there. Because if I can get the Baba in there, then I can actually get the wind. And we need to get a Baba to the flag after we make it flag as win. But I need to get the Baba or the rocket into the win in order to get it to is win. Yeah, that works. Baba is push. I need I need to be able to make Baba's push and then push Baba to the right. We're almost there actually. We just need to get Baba like two more spaces to the right and then we're golden. So let's see if we can actually do that here. Oh, like this. Good. Yeah, that's right. Baba's in the correct position. And it's even ready for a Baba is you, I think. So then we p push the... Spaceship in... To, uh, in here? I can't move the spaceship anymore. It's fine. Move the spaceship up. Flag is win. Okay. But empty is you is actually just stuck there because we need to make Baba is you. Good lord! These empty is you puzzles are a bit too much for me, says Relta Cut. <laughs> this is a tough one. This is a, a very tough one.
Okay. Baba. Ooh, 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 ooh. Baba is you. Flag is win. Honestly, that's just trial and error. I didn't really have a plan except just push it around and hope that it worked. Area complete? Don't do the bonus level again, you 